Selim Kaji has become one of South Africa's most popular pop opera performers and recently he introduced an Indian element to his backing orchestra. Mashal attended the show. Every day I wake up, then I start to break up, knowing that it's cloudy above. Every day I start out, then I cry my heart out, lonely as a man. Having mesmerized audiences across South Africa and abroad with his classical voice since the release of his debut album Cry for Love, Salim Kaji is staging a once-off musical experience and Cape Town is serving as the perfect backdrop. Salim is uniting the East with the West as he performs some of the world's most popular songs and I'm meeting up with him just before the show to find out how it all came about. Tell her about my While Salim would be the star of the show, success would depend on the synergy between the conductor and musicians, as well as the sound and lighting teams, and everyone was striving for perfection. Salim, pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you. And welcome back to Mela. Thank you so much. With a playlist that includes some of your favorite songs to perform, you've added an Indian element to it. What inspired you to do this? Even though I'm singing a lot of Italian music, a lot of English music, and a classical pop style, the fan base and the support have actually been a lot of Indian people, which is, which is heartwarming and fantastic. So I thought I wanted to sort of meet them halfway and bring some Indian flavors into the sound and to the music. Salim, I definitely want to chat more. Should we head off? Absolutely, let's go. Now, how did you assemble your musicians and the various instruments that will be played here tonight? It has been very challenging. Combining these instrumentalists, we've got sitar, we've got uh, bansuri flute, we've got tabla. Because their music is not scored like an orchestra is, we've had to have many, many workshops with them and for them to rehearse with a pianist. I mean, that took many, many months of, of practice, but they, they have wonderful energy and they're very committed and I'm, I'm very honored to work with them. If you can breathe and if you can learn to speak, you can learn to sing. It's words that you heard as a youngster. Now, what words of encouragement would you have for the next generation? It's important to know yourself, it's important to find your style, find your genre and it's important to be authentic to who you feel represents you in terms of your sound as a singer and be inspired by people that have done things great. The Eastern Trio featured sitarist Akash Srikawal, Vishen Kamraj on tablas and Liao K. Parker playing the bansuri or bamboo flute. Wow, that has sounded amazing, gents. What's Thanks. it like working on this production? It's something different, something beautiful, out of this world for me because I'm used to playing Eastern music most of the time. Never played English music before. It has been a beautiful journey for me. It's really exciting, lots of learning in it, and um, I'm really looking forward to the unique performance that we're putting together. And for yourself, what has the experience been like? Working with Salim is such an awesome experience. His tone production, his timbre, his emotions in the songs is absolutely phenomenal. James, what do you hope that the audience will take away here tonight? The first thing they would take from this experience is something really new. Uh, they would hear a very fresh sound to classics that Salim is going to be singing. It's going to be a mind-blowing performance tonight. Absolutely. James, thank you so much and good luck for the show. I look so forward to watching you from the seats. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Salim's voice had already earned him a dedicated following among lovers of light music in the Western Cape. With the audience settled comfortably in their seats, it was the moment of truth for Salim. Go to a party And everyone turns to see This beautiful lady That's walking around with me I feel wonderful tonight. <laughs> Oh, so, oh, so.
Ein Frontier Selim had pulled it off, and some proud family members awaited him. With his distinctive romantic style and brand of music on display here tonight, it's so obvious to see why he is so popular. Now my favorite renditions have to have been Oh Solo Mio and Can't Help Falling In Love. Selim is world class. <laughs> <laughs> 